In the 608 this morning, we have a preview of a big event set to happen this coming weekend at the Southern Wisconsin Regional Airport. Oh, yeah, Josh Breider is live in Janesville with what folks can expect. He's having breakfast a little early this morning. Hey, Josh. Look at that. Was that dramatic enough for you, Mark Schilling? <laughs> that was a good one. He's like, you got to get that whole syrup going this morning. Hey, guys, look at this. We've got the fresh stack of cakes already going here this morning. Bessie's set to open here in just a few minutes at 7 o'clock this morning. And we're here a few days early getting you all excited for their fourth annual pancake breakfast. It's a fly and drive in style and it's all for a good cause this morning. I want to bring in Brooklyn Weeks this morning. She's the assist assistant general manager here. You guys are super excited, already prepared for Saturday. Yes, we are. Big event for us on Saturday. So this is the fourth time that you guys are doing this and this year you guys are going bigger than ever. You actually had to get a refresh refrigeration truck because you <laughs> ordered so much food. Yes, it's going to be big. We're very excited for it. What can folks expect on the menu this year? Yeah, pancakes, bacon, sausage, and then drinks. We have coffee, milk, and orange juice. So this is all in partnership with Elevation Air. We also are, of course, right here on the runway of the Southern Wisconsin Regional Airport. You can see one plane out there. One plane just took off. They were on a training flight this morning. So that is another option. There's going to be really fun for the whole family this weekend. Yeah, they can dig in um, with the pancakes and everything. There will be display planes, um, vintage, new, and then there's also the opportunity to go up in the air with the planes too for a discovery flight. So we uh, talk about this being all for a good cause and you guys are really here for supporting a local cause here in the community. Yeah, we're partnered with CARETAS for this event. Um, they're a resource community center for the state line. They're super local. Um, they have food, clothing, uh, diapers, formula for anybody that needs those resources. So when folks come out on Saturday, not only are they going to have a fantastic time and a great breakfast they're going to be giving back to the community too yes it's very important to us you know especially in these times you know why is it so important to support local yeah i mean we're all here for each other times are difficult for everybody so whatever we can do to help out we love to so yeah here at bessie's diner this coming saturday everything starts at seven o'clock saturday correct yes seven to two so if people are interested uh, just show up Yep, they can come in. Um, we'll get tickets and everything. Otherwise, if they want to buy their tickets pre-sale, they're more than welcome to. Those will be online through Eventbrite, and they can get there through our website, BessiesDiner.com. How many pounds of bacon are you going to go through? Oh, boy. I think we ordered nearly 300 pounds. 300 pounds of bacon? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Well, Brooklyn, thank you so much. Okay, I've been waiting for too long for this moment. We're going to dig into the pancakes here. Look at that stack. I think I put enough syrup on there this morning, guys. <laughs> Mm, mm hmm That hits the spot right there, guys. If you want to learn more, you can go to channel3000.com. You can tell I think Mark Schilling, and he's drooling over there, too. He wants to dig in, too, guys, this morning. A lot of fun here in Janesville. So, are you going to save us some? <laughs> <laughs> I love how I always know where this is going to go. So are you uh, bringing some back for us? We'll see. I don't know. I'm mighty hungry. I think uh, Photog Mark Schilling has been uh, deserving this year this morning, too, with all the movement we've been doing. So That's true. we'll see if there's a little bit, maybe a little taste as we come back to Madison, guys. That's true. Mark gets first tips, but just a little bite for your buddy, Leah. <laughs> Josh Breider, thank you very much. If this was only a, like a smell of vision or a taste of vision, <laughs> I, know. I know. You would know how good this is right You're now. Oh, buddy. You gotta put something on those pancakes, buddy. <laughs> He put syrup on him. What do you think? You want more? I, no, I mean, it already, where's it the, already where's like the fruit? in. We'll put a little bit more. Don't where's the whipped cream? It. Oh, the fruit? Fruit, whipped cream, powdered syrup. This We're talking about all the different oh, boy, things Mark that we put on showing. pancakes. Stanford, these are going to be all soggy <laughs> by the time I get back. Mark just sent the Come hot on. sauce over to me. Get no, that out I of can't. Here. I'm more get traditional. I'm very traditional when it comes to my pancakes. Picky man over here. To each their own. I really want some pancakes now, though. I will say that. Hey, don't forget to let Josh know what inspires you in the 608. Reach out on social media or email him for a chance to be featured.